We started to see multiple spirits in the house. The Conjuring is a horror film based off of the true story of the Perrin family. It's standing right behind you. The film, directed by the same guy who brought you Saw and Insidious, is guaranteed to leave you with a few chills. We had a chance to talk to the cast and see if their experience on set changed their belief in Ghost. I didn't before. Uh, I do believe in it a little bit percentage more now. It was, uh, I learned a lot when I was filming and it, it kind of changed my, uh, changed my thoughts about the paranormal world. Yeah, yeah, I do. No, I'm, I'm, I'm agnostic, I'm undecided. Which, which says a lot, which says a lot. We, we kind of all come up with our ideas of what we believe in and what we don't believe in, but where the scary comes in is when that's kind of thrown into question. It's supernatural in every conceivable sense of the word. We moved in as a family of seven, a perfectly normal family of seven, and we left ten years later as a paranormal family. And when you are touched by spirit, it's a door you cannot close. It is a gift from God you cannot return. And if you accept it and you embrace it and you allow that assimilation and integration to occur, it is life altering. Is it like a ghost protocol? Are you supposed to stop, drop, and roll? Are you supposed to run, like, scream fire? Like, what do you do when you see a ghost? We should actually create a conjuring handbook for the ghost protocol. Conjuring handbook, ghost protocol. Um, Step one would probably be to scream as loud as you can. Uh, step two, I think you're supposed to say leave, you're not allowed here, like tell them to get out very firmly. Um, step three would, I guess, is like an exorcism or something like that. You just kind of picture white light around you. It, it all has to do with energy. Some, some are just lost souls and some have malicious intentions. I, I would say get out of there. I would say get out and get out fast. I, I don't, don't mess around if, if they come across, just say, I mean no harm, goodbye. When you see a ghost for real, honey, you won't be able to do anything except draw your breath into your body and hold it there and ask yourself if what you're seeing is real. Who is that? If you want to find out if ghosts are real, you can check out The Conjuring July 19th at a theater near you.